What is up, YouTube? Violence yeah. Closet back again when you get another video. I'm sorry for the messy background. I'm trying to get this in as soon as possible, and I think I may have established Wi Fi for my uh, place, so hopefully, I can get this video either uh, tomorrow or especially this weekend. I just got this package in, and I have a whole surge of videos coming in. They're just sitting in the vault on my computer, my laptop. So, forget all that shit. Let's just get into the review. Hope you guys are having a good one. I have a treat for us today. This is going to be the first and only review that is on YouTube that I've seen that is an English review for this hoodie and this is one of the most iconic hoodies of all time and especially one of the most um, instrumental uh, ideas that I would say that launched this brand and put it out there and left a lot of other brands like fast uh, fashion brands like H&M whatever or Forever 21 to come up with a gimmick to copy the same idea that this brand created also just be tour merch the same thing and um just the overall just i don't know the hoodie i'm just happy to own it pretty much like that's all i could really say i'm 100 authentic you guys already know got it for an amazing deal i was going to buy a gucci hoodie which i a gucci uh gucci belt which i still am for this deal i just and for the condition i just couldn't pass up on it like i just had to get it so therefore as i'm talking right now you guys are seeing most likely an unboxing of me just opening up the package and everything but if you guys didn't already get to the point and see what it was here it is are you guys ready i'm gonna have to do a uh hoodie video like a hoodie collection because I've been copying so much shit like I probably have like 15 hoodies right now or 20 I don't know probably more yeah all right anyways this is good to it so here it is three two one first I'm gonna show you it says you know that mon so you guys know what's that one hoodie I had to cop another one and I think I'm just gonna cop one more I'm gonna cop the Remsen one I'm not as hungry for it but I got this probably one of my grills but the Remsen one's also one I do really want but anyways here it is boom <laughs> I am so happy to own this shit. Like this is the Titanic hoodie from Vetmon. One of the most iconic hoodies of all time in streetwear, period. Like Supreme Box logo, uh, I would say super iconic. Uh, Caravaggio, um, off-white hoodie, super iconic. There's off-white hoodies in general with the stripes on the side, iconic. This Vetmon hoodie, extremely iconic and go is going for a crazy price right now i've seen them go upwards to 2200 on 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 grail i'm not paying for that shit i feel like no one else is but i've seen people crazy enough to try to sell it for that much i uh, usually go they go for around a k um to 1200 but fortunately i got away under that 100 uh, authentic i'll show you guys the tags and everything as i'm speaking but here it is man vetmon hoodie titanic hoodie uh it says coming soon on the side on both sides right here coming soon the quality is thick and there is a thin version there's a thick version uh i did not expect the thick one to be this thick like it's extremely extremely thick overly big exaggerated hood exaggerated sleeve this is part of the spring oh, not the spring summer the fall winter collection from 2016 and i can just by touching it compared to the other vet hoodie i have the one is all white and also the black maxfield collab split one those two i believe are from spring summer 2018 and i can definitely feel it you know the difference because they're a lot lighter um the quality of this one like i said it's really heavy it's a size medium and it fits like a double xl for i'm um, six foot and it fits like a double xl so i'm going to have this on body so you guys can see what it looks like on and just know as a reference i'm six foot like i said and I'll, I'll give you measurements too in the description box below so you guys can have the right measurements of this hoodie if you guys plan on buying this or a um, Vetmon hoodie from the same collection. Now the materials overall, I believe it's made out of 80% cotton and 20% polyester and the type of uh, fabric they use inside is going to be a French terry cotton. This is a really heavy, thick French terry cotton. I promise you, this would definitely be good enough for the whole fall season without you having to layering anything without you having to layer anything on top. So the tag on the inside by the neck is gonna say Denma Gafasalia. I Gafasilia, I don't really Gafasella, I don't wanna butcher it, but there he goes. Um on the inside it says Vetmon Porfeme Tricots it did 2016 Porter. I don't really want to butcher that too, but I hope I said it right. I know some good ways to pretty much like legit check this is definitely gonna be the drawstrings. Um, they shouldn't come in like shoe drawstrings. They should come in like this. This is extra thick and extra spongy This is what the drawstring should look like the print on the um, Titanic print on the front should not be too too dark I've seen a lot of them online which are like extra dark um, they should not be dark They should be light and the face should be like purplish like a purplish like greenish hue the tag and the inside too Like where it says Vetmon was also a good way to check too as well. So, I mean obviously you can see it's right here. So you guys that for yourself. I'll show the tags on the inside and on body. Um, this is gonna be one of the like my most worn hoodies like this whole entire like season for sure. I mean, this one and the red Tommy Hilfiger one are gonna be like the two I'm trying to like wear out because those two are definitely my favorite that I caught for this season so far, hoodie wise. I mean, the Maxfield one was actually really sick too. Um, I don't know, dude. I, I just, I copped a lot of stuff. Uh, 
So this is definitely gonna be heavy in rotation, especially because it's so thick. Like I literally walk out with just a t-shirt like this from Fog Essentials. It's not from Essentials, it's from just regular Fog, oversized gray tee, boxy tee. I just walk out with this and wear this and I'll be totally fine in like some 50 degree weather because it's literally that thick. So super excited that I cop this. The dude I called from, shout out to you, even though you were kind of suspect because he, he he wanted me to, to PayPal him. He wanted, I was going to PayPal him, but he wanted me to gift it to him so he can avoid fees. He has 100% feedback, but just to protect myself, I was not going <laughs> to do that. Like, he was definitely have to send that invoice. But uh, yeah, so he got that out of the way. He was whole, total, like, you know, good communication. It's just that one thing that kind of made me like, well, I don't know if I should do this, but happy I did it anyways. I'm proud of the product and um, I got it from eBay, you know, so shout out the eBay. Yeah, dude. Uh, I really, I really don't know what else to say about this. The print on the on the sleeves is also is actually like a fine print too as well. I know a big a big issue that I know a lot of a lot of the Titanics have is that the print tends to chip, and this one does have a tiny tiny chip on the O, which is coming soon. Totally percent, totally fine with that. I need to get that fixed or repaired or whatever. Yeah, other than that, like this thing is pretty much an impeccable condition it's perfect and i cannot complain the print on the hood part is fine too it's, it's perfect no no complaints about that as well super exaggerated sleeves super huge drop shoulder super oversized hood super boxy fit i think it's 27 inches wide and i know it's 20 it's like 28 27 inches long for my size medium and it's like 27 inches wide so this thing is like super super huge definitely can see wearing some definitely some saving around with this as well wide boots is definitely gonna be the the look with this skinny jeans white st laurent boots the black suede i'm coming for you this black friday christmas season but uh yeah that's pretty much it i appreciate you guys for watching tune in i'm going to be shooting the other triple s video after this so you expect to see that soon and expect the lookbook to come soon as well i know you guys don't want to see that just I'm just gonna keep posting so we can grow this channel. If you guys for watching, tune in. All my social media are the end card and the description box below in the beginning of this video. Uh, my Instagram, my Twitter, my Snapchat. Also, my other YouTube channels are down in the description box below. My main channel, which is by 100 k so go over and subscribe to that if you guys aren't already subscribed. And my reaction channel as well. Go check that out in the description box below. And yeah, if you guys for watching, tune in for Valentino's Closet. This is Million Dollar Dream originally. Sign up for yet another Million Dollar video. If you're on Follow Dreams, what are you doing? I'm out. Peace. Yeah, fuck these niggas cause they always been extra All these diamonds on me, I don't feel no pressure